everybody, welcome to La Belle Province. Along with Ray Ferraro, I'm Jane Sabalski here in Montreal, Quebec. The Canadians are closing out their homestand tonight and it has been favorable for them here. Not always the case, James. Sometimes you come home for a long stretch of games, the team plays poorly, the fans get agitated, one thing leads to another and it's a rotten stain. Not this time. A sight every hockey fan can appreciate. It's a clean sheet of ice and we are about to get underway. The Jets take possession here on the opening draw and we are underway. Circles back to center ice. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Line. A. Oh, caught him with his head down. And makes the save. And it's in. He scores. Gets his own rebound and makes it count. That's poor defending. He gets chasing the puck here. And eventually, he's so far out of position, he can't get back to the slot to cover the dangerous area. Winnipeg's got that lead. They were talking about wanting to quiet that home crowd here. Well, they certainly did. Out of the gate quickly, a couple of shifts. Now they're up 1-0. Puck grabbed by Weber. Domi's got it along the wing. Big time stop there. Save made by the goalie. Oh, he's locked right in. A couple of stops in a row there. On the attack along the boards. Reads it perfectly in the defensive end. A chance on goal. Blocker save, and he's showing up big time tonight. Big stop by the keeper. After the first stop, he's in good position to make a second. That's a solid hit. Big hit. He got banged up somewhere along this shift. He's not anywhere near full strength. He's just trying to get the puck out of the zone so he can get off the ice. And it's a quick pass to Lykanen. The Jets get a hold of the puck in their own end. Steps into all of that. Montreal gained possession along the boards. And now it's over to Gallagher. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. Slides it over to Lekanen. And the puck skips out of the zone. They'll have to regroup. On the doorstep, he scores! What an effort to get this game back to level. You've got to continue to work even when you trail in the game. They did that, and now they have a brand new game to play. One timed into the net, everybody is puck watching. The guy carrying it behind the net. I know he's got the puck, but the dangerous guy is behind you. He's in front of the net. Still lots of time left in the period. We are all tied up in this one. This neutral zone face-off set to go, and we are back underway. Good hit on the play. Sharat's taking it from his own end. Quick feed to cut Kaniemi. Shot in front. Stopped by the goaltender. Oh, here we go. Quick pass to Roslevic. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Winnipeg's got it now. Too much traffic in the lane. And he slides it quickly to Lowry. Puts it just wide of the net. Montreal's got the puck along the wall. Armia's carrying it ahead. Here's a shot. That's off a stick. Off target. You don't get the puck dead center very often. He's got to capitalize. You wonder if that'll come back to haunt them. There's the physical side. Dumps it in. Montreal's got the puck along the boards. Here's an odd man rush. An easy stop with the pad by Brossois. Rocks him on the play. Oh, he'll feel that one. Montreal's got the puck in their own end. The Jets ready to go on the attack. And there's the save. In tight, he had to make an excellent save. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Evans brings it in. Oh, the rookie's still looking for his first goal. He's got the puck in the zone. You can shoot it in. Heck, mine went in off my knee. I don't really care how it goes in. One goal is one goal. Levels him with the hit. And they'll dump it in. The Canadians gain possession along the wall. 
coughs it up on the play. Stays with it. They fight for it along the boards. Alsner's got it in the defensive end. They've got numbers. Great heads up play by the defender. Obstruction penalty coming up. Looks like a hook here. And he slides it quickly to Spiza. Gets to the bench for the extra attacker. There's the stoppage of play. Let's see what the officials say. Wheels going off to the box for two minutes. That's kind of a bad penalty to take. You reach out with your hands and the referee sees your stick parallel to the ice. He's gonna call it most times. Well, as both teams dig in for the face-off here just moments away, it's our first opportunity to look at the power play unit here. This is why you have meetings in the morning. You look at video of the penalty killers. You try to establish what their tendencies are gonna be. Push the penalty killers into some place they're not comfortable. Slides it across, and a smart head's trying to gain a step. He's in, all alone. Passes it across, sends it over, slides it across, flips it across with the pass. Passes it across, sends it over, slides it across, stones him on the breakaway. Under siege, and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. Late goings of this period. We got a tie game. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Now a quick pass to Gallagher. Gallagher's got it across the line. Unloads a shot and he comes up with the save. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Receives the pass. Look at that right oh. there. Wow, he lowered the shoulder down. He read that play so cleanly he was able to close up the ice. Nowhere for him to go. Just a cinder block he ran into. And that's broken up. Wheeler swooping in on the attack. Shot makes the save. What a reaction with the blocker. Sends it out right in front. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Dialed in on that stop. Here comes the pushback. Oh, that didn't look very... Yeah, after the teammate got hurt, he jumped right in. He's gonna make him try and pay a price. We got ourselves a fight here. Oh, and he hammers him and sends him down to the ice. That's a clear decision there. Boys, that's enough. Over to the penalty box and go sit down. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Perot's got it in the offensive zone. 19 minutes, one second. C'est le dernier minute de la première période. Impressive effort by the penalty killers as we are back to even strength and we are still tied. Obviously a pretty important time in the game. The PK does a good job, keeps this game tied. Oh, That's boy. intercepted. As the first period comes to an end, this one's still a dead heat. 1-1 is where we sit. are back at center ice and we are ready to get period number two underway. Still tied up here as we get underway here in period number two. Well, we've got over 20 minutes played thus far. Ray, how have you seen things? Winnipeg's focus going forward is going to be to hold on to the puck much better than they did in that turnover-prone first period. Moves it quickly over to Weber. Let's it go! Big time stop! Oh, the 
goalie gave him a quick look after he made the stop. The glove save gives you a little confidence. Lots of time left in this period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. And that one's turned away. Grabbed along the board by DeMello. Closes the gap along the wall. It's a two-on-one. Puck picked up by Shifley. Stopped by the goaltender. High quality chance, high quality save. Picked up along the boards by Domi. He got thunderstruck. From one end of the blue line to the other. Scores! And the deadlock is broken. Well, oh, what a crushing goal to give up. But the other guys worked hard for it. They pressed the play, and now they've got the lead. Oftentimes, the goalie will drop in the butterfly, take the chance that he's got everything covered. Not so here. This is up over the glove. It's a beautiful shot. Winnipeg's given themselves control of this game now with a one-goal lead in the second. They'd like to get another before they go in for the second intermission. You'd love at least a couple goal lead going into period three. And forces a huge turnover here with the steal. The Canadians have been in such good position all night long. Stick position is critical as they continue to intercept a lot of passes. Gets it to the other point. Slides the puck near the front of the net. And now he tries to get it across to Ehlers. Ehlers setting up against the wall. Big time stop. Denies him again. Stop one, stop two. The goalie makes a couple of excellent saves. And now he moves it quickly to Lekanen. Here they are on the attack. Whoa. He scores! Quick shot up over the goaltender and it hits the crossbar. But it ricochets down. Bar down, lovely goal. It's a terrific delivery. Beats the goaltender up high. Gets a lucky break though. It hits the crossbar and bounces into the net. More than half the period left to play. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Moves the puck along the half wall. Montreal's got it behind the net. Passed up ahead. He's got a step. Oh, what a stop by the goaltender. I thought he was beaten, but he makes a nice stop here. While well, he's got two, you think he can get three? He's never had that in the game before. Off the trot, he ties up his opponent. Takes the feed. With possession along the wall. Here's a short pass to Kopp. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. Kicked up ahead to his teammate who skates away. Oh, what a stop! The Jets gain possession in their own end. Looks to pass it to Lowry. Montreal's got possession at center. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. Taken along the wall by Roslevic. Here he is, wrists it on net. Oh, puts it wide! No, he's got to get that on target. That's a scoring chance, and he doesn't even make a, the goaltender make a save. And that one stopped. Well past the midway mark of this period. It's all tied up. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. With the stop. And it's a quick pass to Shaw. Good hit on the play. Montreal's got a hold of it along the wall. Gets the puck over to Weber. Here's a howitzer at the net. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. And he slides it quickly to Line. A. And he slides it quickly to Shifley. Huge hit. Oh. He got all of that one, Ray. Yeah, that is direct oh. contact. What a solid hit. He laid out right from the bottom of his feet, right through the top of his shoulders. Big hit. Well, he's gonna have to pick himself up, but then he's gotta go get his twig, which is slid all the way over there before he can get back into play. 
Line A's got the puck. Montreal's got control of it now from their own end. Winnipeg's ready to go on the attack. Strong use of the body. Looking to make something happen along the boards. They're going to have to look at him immediately. He's just slowly working his way to the bench, James. Moves it ahead from off the wall. Over the line they come. Hammers one. And that banks off a stick. Moves it to Ehlers. He got all of that hit. Makes the save. They're working really hard these days to make sure when they stop the puck, it doesn't stay in front of them. If they can't stop it and catch it, they want that puck in the corner. Can't maintain possession after that hit. Puts it towards the net, gobbles that puck up with his chest. There's the end of period number two. It's still deuces wild here. It's time to support those around us with our monthly food drop. Bring three non-perishable food items. Welcome back, everyone. Both teams lined up at center ice, and we are ready to get this third period underway. This one's still deadlocked as we are now underway here in the third. They've got the defense outnumbered. Sends wow. it over. Scores! And he puts his team in front. James, this game looked really comfortable as a tie game. Now they're ahead. They've got to continue to push. Really good work in the offensive zone here as the shooter keeps moving around till he finds the open spot. In this case, it's gold. He's in the high slot, and he hammers it home. The Canadians come up with a big goal here in the third. There's a difference between sitting back and protecting and trying to grow the lead. I always like the team that works to make a one-goal lead, too. Here's a shot from the boards, and he comes up with a big-time save on that. His ability to create in several different ways makes him tough to handle. It's probably why he's in the top of the league in points. Montreal's outplayed the opposition tonight, particularly offensively, as they lead it early in this third period. Domi's won the draw. That goes off a twig. Puck scooped up by Drouin. Off a stick. The Jets get a hold of the puck along the boards. And the puck leaves the zone. Petrie's got the puck in his own zone. And now he angles it across to Drouin. Winnipeg's looking to break out of their own end. Good hit. And that's taken by the defense. Montreal's bench is constantly saying, good sticks, good sticks. They intercept the puck, they turn it over, and they can attack. This will be a close game all the way to the end. There's another stop. Really good stop. After he made the first one, he's got to find the puck, and he's in position again. Stopped by the goaltender. <laughs> Takes that pass back at the point. Quick feed to Spiza. Knocked away. Picked up along the wall by Drouin. And we've got a two-on-one. Here he is from the slot. Stopped by the goaltender. Quick pass to Little. With authority. Solid hit on that play. Montreal's gained possession. Quick pass over to Gallagher. On the doorstep, can't connect. Scooped up along the wall by Lekanen. Way too much congestion blocks that. Puts a little mustard on the hit to knock the puck loose. Along the half wall with the puck. Now a quick pass to Lekanen. Moves up near the blue line and looks to set up at the point. Oh, comes up with a stop. Lays into the body on the play. With the steal. Slides it diagonally to Lekanen. Fires it. Stops him cold. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. 3-2 is where we're sitting. Lowry's won the faceoff. Moves it quickly over to Kopp. Dumps it into the Ozone. Montreal's got a hold of it against the wall. 
Here's a short pass to Armia. Here they come on the attack. Hammers a shot. Brilliant save. Read it perfectly. Montreal's attempt to put more pucks on net has paid off as they lead it in the third. And a solid job tying up his opponent. And he gains the zone here. Huge steal in his own end. Takes it across the blue line. Rips it. Dropper save! The Canadians have never really had a bad stretch this season. They've played well, they've played consistently, and when you look at their position in the standings, it shows you pretty much that this is the league's best team. Kakaniemi's won the draw here in the offensive zone. And that's blocked away. Feeds the puck to Polia. Polia's gonna play it against the half wall. Right in front, off the post. He gets a piece of it with a stick. The Canadians grab possession to the puck. Sends it across the ice. Makes his presence known on the ice. The Jets gain control of the puck against the wall. Takes the feed. Montreal's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Carries it in. And they'll be forced to tag up after that missed pass. And now it's grabbed by Kulak. Montreal's got a hold of the puck. Uses the force on that hit. Feeds it on over to Shifley. Moves it around along the half wall. Winnipeg's got the puck along the boards. Comes up with the stop. A critical draw here. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. You'll need more than that to beat him. Tatar's moving it ahead. Under a minute to go here in regulation time. Turns it away on the slap shot. The Jets gain possession along the wall. Slides the puck over to Ehlers. Takes the feed from the left side. Moves it to Little. Traps that puck tight into his chest. They desperately need a goal. The net is empty and the extra attacker's out. Wide open net. Oh. And there's the insurance marker much needed for them on this night. It's amazing how many times a guy misses an empty net. But this one he puts between the pipes. Now that empty netter should wrap this up here. We're in the last little bit of the third period. That should be enough. Montreal's added to their lead with the empty netter, and Ray, that's pretty much all she wrote, I would say. Well, you grind away to get the lead through this much of the game, and they pull the goalie, they're gonna pressure you. You put it away with an easy one into the empty net. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Goaltender has made his way to the bench. The extra attacker's out. They need a goal here big time. Long jam in front, that's broken up. Here's a shot, and makes the save. Montreal's not far from the finish line here as they lead it late in this third. Deneau's won it off the faceoff. Lekkonen's gaining momentum. Here's a chance. He scores! And this place is going bananas. They know what the moment's all about. Well, I guess we know who the first star's probably gonna be. That's three for him tonight. Oh, now you got a couple of goal lead here with the empty netter. That should be enough to put this away. The Canadians are going to want to bring this big lead home late in the third. Little's won the draw. His third of the game, scored by number 62. Slides it back to the blue line. Shuts him down. And there it is. This one's all over. 
Lekkonen's hat trick leads the way in this victory. Ray, your thoughts at ice level? Goal scorers are supposed to score. He had opportunities and he did not miss tonight. And that'll do it from a very entertaining night of hockey here this evening for Ray Ferraro. My name is James Sabalski. Bonsoir!